After doing about 60 legend analysis videos, it's about time I show how they're made. And honestly, it's done in the way you'd think it'd be done. In the past, they used to be really short and only went to about 3 or 4 minutes of a video. My Asuri analysis, for example. Now, they're at least over 6 minutes, and sometimes even 8 minutes long. I'll be using my Mirage analysis redone since it's my most recent analysis. Enough stalling, let's get to it. First off, I typically start off with the script. I'm usually in training mode when going over a lot of this stuff, seeing how good or bad some SIGs really are. From just personal experience, but also their force, damage, frame data, all that biz. I put any of my thoughts or extra info out at the beginning and end, go over the SIGs afterwards, skins, where I think they are balance-wise, stats, and play rate. I've got the order pretty much down, while in the past it was more scrambled. So, once I write the script, I usually record the audio first. Of course, there's some mess-ups while I record, which I simply just cut out. Usually right afterwards, I record gameplay for the whole video. A few experimental games usually is enough. After that, I record gameplay for the SIG overview. It's hard to match it directly, but playing the audio while I do it helps tremendously. This part is probably my least favorite, honestly. That's most of the stuff I need to get at the current moment. Now is just editing it all together. My audio is what I usually do first, so then I can match the gameplay with it later. I also get all the Brawlhalla renders I need while I edit, because sometimes I never know what I'll need. Same with Brawlman's play rates and stats. Just anything that ends up becoming relevant in the video. Once again, audio is first, gameplay is second. While I do the video, I also do the extra bits I throw in, like renders, play rates, etc. I also include whatever background music I decide to add. Sometimes I do it first, and sometimes I do it last. It really doesn't matter too much. I match it with the sections of the video being the first half, then the skins by itself, and then the tier list wise of SA, BC, and D section onward. I like to mix up a lot, but Mario Kart is what I usually default to. Besides that, I just make sure everything's edited correctly, see if there's any mistakes I've made, which usually there are, and then I export, get a thumbnail, and bam, that's the video. That's my short explanation on how an analysis is made. Thanks for watching, and as usual, keep on brawling.